What's good, y'all? Yeah, before the video even starts, everybody hit that like button and subscribe if you're new. Because you already know we on the road to 600 K, hey man, y'all let me know what y'all think about the dress. Should I keep them? Should I keep them this color, or y'all think I should dye them again? Y'all already know I had them blonde before. But if I'm being honest, I only, you know, I only put them, you know, back regular kinda, cause I wasn't really feeling the color no more. But I think I low key might want to do it. Nah, I don't know. Should I keep it plain, y'all? I think I might keep it plain. But anyways, hold on. Before we even get into this video, I gotta take a shot. You feel me? Hey, cause if I, that means if I make this shot, that means this video is gonna go smooth. Like everything about this video is gonna be good. But if I miss, ain't no telling what's going to happen. Let's see, man. All the luck is in the ball. <sighs> oh, my God. All right, y'all. But I know y'all. Oh, hold on. Camera falling. But like I was about to say, I know y'all see that title, man. So today we about to be doing $20 BB gun versus $200 BB gun. Pistol edition. If y'all hear a lot of drops, it's because it's raining right now. And y'all literally like near the window. So, yeah, y'all gonna hear a few drops. It's raining, man. But let me show you the $20 gun. Where's it at? Who took my blitz? Bow. This right here. Oh, my God. It's already falling apart. Oh, my God. This right here, like I try to say, is the $20 pistol. And y'all probably wondering, what did the $200 pistol? Wait, before we even get to the $200 pistol. Oh, damn. Look at this. Already messing up. Come on now. Got BBs falling out. Put this down real quick. But yeah, look, let's take a little look at this, you feel me? Ooh. See, I gotta put some, I kinda, kinda gotta put some force to do that. Put safety down. Boom. Here's a safety flick. Y'all can hear it. Test sound. Feel me? Damn, it's hard to cock back. Put that mag in there. That's what it looked like. That's what it sound like. I, I can't really feel it, but y'all can hear it. Y'all can see it. Let me go grab that two hundred dollar gun, man. I ain't go. Hold on. Let me explain it once I grab it. Boop, 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 boop. We got that four five. I know y'all probably thought I was gonna grab my Glock eighteen C because y'all already know my Glock eighteen C pistol. It got a switch and it's automatic. This one don't, but this one was actually two hundred dollars flat. So, the Glock 18C was like $220. I just thought about it. That's definitely way more worth it. You pay like $20 or it was like $40 more. I think it was like $240, I think. Regardless, you pay $20, $40 more, you get the 18C switch. And this don't even come with an extended mag. This comes with a standard mag. I just like, I bought this extra mag. So, the 18C is definitely better than this. But, we're just going to go with the flat-on $200 gun versus $20 gun. So now let's play around with this one. Let's, let's do the sounds. Let's take out the mag. Look, just hear the difference by me putting down the mag. Hmm. Look how smooth this is. See the difference? Mmm. Trigger. Mmm. Clean. Let's hear it. Test sound. Sound like metal to me. Yo, this mag is heavy. Put that in there. Ooh. Oh, there's no green gas in there? Damn, I forgot. Um... I think I, um, put that down. I think, bro, I think I ran out of green gas. But I just had a can. But I don't know where it went. That thing disappeared. But I'm about to grab that. But first, let's test out this. Oh, wait, how am, I, how am I supposed to test this out? What are we doing? What are we doing? Should I just, you know what? I'm about to, how much shots are in here? Oh, there's no shots in here. You got these BBs. All right, we got one shot. Hold on. Damn. I guess we don't got a shot in there. All right, pick that up. That's crazy. I just, whenever I need some BBs, whenever I need some BBs, all I got to do is bend down, dig in my carpet, probably go find some, some BBs in there. Boom. One in the head. What's the first test? Oh, should we do like a, um? should we do like a, um, let me see. Damn, I just bought this book. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. If y'all remember these days, man, Diary of a Wimpy Kids. Hey, back in my days when I was in like elementary school, this used to be the book, bro. Even middle school, even high school, son. Well, not high school. I probably didn't read no Diary of a Wimpy Kid. But I recently got a book again. I had this here for like a month now, and I haven't read it. Or like two months, and I haven't read it. No, it's like a month now. But I don't know. I'm gonna I'm probably read it soon. 
I don't know. I just got it because I was bored. But that's besides the point. This is about to be the first test because this is hard book. We about to see if this can put a dent in here or not. Which way should I shoot? Should I shoot in the front? Yeah, let's shoot the front. Here we go. A, safety first, man. I'm going to put on my safety glasses. As y'all can see, I got my safety glasses on. They are invisible. I paid 100000 for them. Y'all can't see them. That's why they cost so much. They're invisible. But anyways, here we go, man. Three, two, one. What the? Safety. See, it was on safety, man. I told you I safety first. Here we go. Three, two, one. Oh. Oh. Can y'all see that? Barely. Like, it's, it's, it's in there, though. Y'all can see that. Barely. It's there, though. Y'all see the damage. I bet that four or five probably gonna go right through that thing. But damn. All right, so we did the book. Now, let me let me get one more thing to flock at. One more thing to get popped so we can really test this thing out. Um, I don't think I got nothing to pop. So we're gonna try... We're gonna do an accuracy test. An accuracy test real quick. We're gonna get the... um. What should I grab? I, yo, I'd be too unprepared for this, bro. I already got to be prepared and have everything set up before I even do this. But y'all stay tuned. I'm going to find something so I can do this, this test. Bro, this right here is the real test. And I'm still kind of debating if I should even do this or not. Because, bro, I already have a whole bunch of holes. Look, look. These are from BBs. Can I see that? Yeah, those are from BBs, bro. I'm not trying to put another hole in my wall. But y'all can see that bottle right there. Y'all see how it's set up, bro. If I miss, I'm hitting the wall. So this $5, well, I said $5. This $20 gun better have some accuracy. Because if I miss, bro. Because look, if I miss, it's not on me. Because I'm going to be aiming properly. Y'all already know. When I was out in Texas, I was training for this moment right here. I was training with the, uh, you know, I got my aim right. You feel me? Got my aim right. All that. So if I miss... It has to be something wrong with the gun. It's not me. Let me grab a BB. Damn, there's already a BB in there. I just dropped it. Where it went? Let me dig in my carpet. Damn. Yeah, I think I'm running out of BBs. Right. I'm not running out of BBs. I got a whole pack right here. But let me open this thing up. Yo, I better not put no hole in my wall, bro. Oh, my God. It's just one hole. I'm not going to miss, bro. Too golden for this. Come on. Low cap can't miss. Hold on, I need one more BB. Comment down below right now, y'all predictions. Am I going to hit or am I going to miss? And be honest. Don't lie. Y'all believe in me or y'all don't believe in me? I think I think I might hit. Nah, I'm going to end up missing. I know I'm going to hit the wall. I already know it. Let me not wish that. Hold on. I got to have confidence. Got to believe in myself. Here we go, y'all. And it's like 10 feet. 10 feet. This is, bro, I'm literally aiming perfectly. So if I miss, it has to be the alignment with the gun. Like, something got to be wrong, literally. All right, here we go. I definitely hit it. Let's go. But the only problem is it bounced off the bottom and hit this wall. But... I'm not tripping about this wall. Oh, I see exactly where it did the damage. I'm not tripping about this wall because, as y'all can see, everybody got the hose. But I think, oh, never mind. <laughs> I'm about to say, I think, I think that was it. But there's so much other hose right here. Oh, my God, there's so much more. Yo, this got to be stopped. But at least they're not hole holes, you feel me? Like, you can just probably, like, scrape that down and, like, fix it up. It's cool, though. I just know I'm not going to be getting my deposit back whenever I do move out of here. All right. So, we got that. Oh, let's see the damage. Did I miss, though? Look, not that I missed. Didn't make a hole. No, I didn't make a hole, but y'all can see where it hit. Damn, y'all can't even see that. It's kind of reflecting off. But it's a little dent right there. I knew it wasn't going to go through the bottle, but... Wait, let me make sure. Is that the dent? Unless this is the dent. Can I see it? I can't really see. It's a little dent, though. But it didn't go through, but I definitely hit it. I don't know if y'all heard that, but I definitely hit it. So, W aim. Now that we got that out the way, it's time for that full five. Here we go. But I got to find some green gas because, as you can see, no gas in that bit. Y'all stay tuned. Oh, that makes so much sense. Whole time I'm thinking all my green gas and all my BBs just disappeared. But they were all in like a bag, in one bag under my bed. But I thought it was like in a different bag. I don't know, but we got the green gas, man. Let's put this gas in this bag. See what's up. Ooh, 
yo, that thing is about to. Oh, this thing about to shoot crazy. Oh, it's leaking. Don't tell me my mag is broke. Don't tell me this mag broke, bro. There's no, it's still doing it. I did put too much gas. I did not put that much gas. I only had it there for like two, three seconds. It's still going. All right, let me just shoot before the gas runs out. There's no way, bro. This mag alone is like a, is like ninety dollars. So it's like, damn. I don't want to have to buy another one. Y'all hear it? Let's see. It's still going. We got one there. Wait, what was the first test? I think the book was the first test, but this one, I'm gonna stay a little back. We gonna put the book right here. Damn, it's gonna bounce off though, and this is a four or five. This is my wall. Y'all already know what's up. Uh, actually, there's like a curtain right here, so if it bounces off, it's gonna hit the curtain. So don't try this at home, y'all. Safety first. Y'all can see I got my glasses on. Here we go. Oh, why? Y'all heard the BB too, right? Why is there no damage? Hold on, did it even shoot? Don't tell me my four or five broke. Oh, it definitely did. Oh, look. I just dropped the four or five. Oh my, yo. That gas is just, oh my God, bro. That four or five is over with. See, that's the problem, bro. It's cause I don't take care of my guns. It's not, not that I don't take care of my guns, I don't use my guns, which is kind of worse. Because, like, if you're not using it, you feel me? It's not, like, getting all that. It's not doing what it's meant to do. So, it's, like, it's going to end up messing up, if that makes sense. But look at the damage, y'all. They're literally right next to each other. That's the 45. You can see it's kind of bigger. And that's the um, that's the Springer. But as you can see, it's not that much bigger, bro. It's not that much of a difference. But one thing about Springers that I can say, half of them be more powerful than these gas guns. Because it's like a spring. You feel me? It's like a spring pushing it. This is just straight gas, like, you know? So, I don't know, but that mag is, is doing something different right now. It's still taking out gas. How much gas is in there? All right, we about to do another bottle test. Hold on. I got two bottles. Okay, this one got less. We about to do another bottle test. This the four or five, though, you feel me? I ain't gonna miss. I already know I ain't gonna miss. But the problem is, I don't want to... Yo, this gas is really... Still coming out. Problem is, I don't want it to bounce back. I mean, I, I like when things bounce back. You feel me? Bounce back. But I don't want no BB bouncing back. Here we go. W aim. I didn't hear no bounce. I did not hear a bounce. So that either means the BB went inside and went through both of the plastic and hit my wall. Or it probably just went through the first plastic and went inside the water. I don't even want to know. Come on, bring that with me. We about to see this together, bro. What happened? What? Oh. I don't see no O. What? Is that it right there? Y'all see that little... What? Oh, was that it? If that was it, that's trash. Yeah, I'm ending this video here. I'm getting tired of this, bro. My four or five, it sound broke. It's still spraying out gas. Let me actually take that out so it don't mess up the, the gun gun. Spraying gas. Well, it's not the gun that's messed up. It's the mag. But get that mag out of there. My my Springer, I don't even know where. Damn. I don't even know where. Oh, it's on my bag. We got Springer here. This thing was also messing up, too. Like, not really messing up, but like... I don't know, bro. I don't even think none of these won, bro. I didn't have I didn't have fun playing with neither one of these things, bro. I should have backed out the ATC. The ATC with the Switch, I always have fun with that. But uh, let me be honest. Which one would I pick? Okay, I feel like this, this would be more fun if you're going around. Even though, you know, it still hurts. So you can't really go around shooting your, you know, your siblings or nothing. But I would say, like, you know, let's say you have, like, one of your friends or your brother or something. Y'all just having a, a war around the house. You know, you can use this. But you can't really use this. Because if you get hit with this, it's going to hurt. So, but, like, more playing around. Like, just target practicing and stuff like that. I feel like this would be, like, you know, it's cheaper. $20, you know. You're not doing too much. But you only need this if you're going outside, bro. If you're about to do a war outside or something like that, that's the only way you would really need this. But if you know you're going to be indoor, bro, save you 180 bucks, use that 20, and cop this. But four or five clean. But, hey, when it comes down to that 18C, 
I'm gonna tell you to drop that 200. You feel me? That ATC go crazy. But anyways, y'all, this is the end of this video. Y'all hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. I'm out of here, y'all. Peace.